everybody, this fight, I will dedicate it to you. This, this, this fight is dedicated. Magandang araw mga boss at welcome back sa ating channel. Manny Pacquiao, walang takot na hinarap ang malarubot na katawan at matangkat na kalaban na galing gana. Dalawang buksingero na hindi pinanganak para maging isang magaling na boxer, kundi ginawang pangtawid guto mga paglaban sa loob ng ring. Dahil sa kahirapan ay pinasok ang pagiging buksingero. Ito ang storya ng dalawang magigiting na boxer na nagtagumpay na makuha ang magandang buhay para sa kanilang minamahal na pamilya. Manny Pacquiao laban sa gananyan boxer na si Joshua Clote, pariho ang dalawa na biniyayaan ng lakas, bilis at matigas na katawan. Nagawang maitawid ang pamilya sa kahirapan, dugo at pawis ang puhunan sa pagtungtong sa ibabaw ng luna. Isang magandang halimbawa na dapat tularan. Patalo man ang isa sa laban ay uuwi pa rin itong panalo dahil nagawa na nitong maipanalo at maiangat ang kanilang pamumuhay. Lumalaban na lang para mag-entertain sa industry ng boxing at makagawa ng legacy sa umaabot na panahon. Sa labang Pacquiao at Clote ay maraming hindi pabor. Bakit palalabanan ni Pacquiao si Clote na tinalo ito ni Koto? At si Koto naman ay tinalo ni Pacquiao. Ano pa ang makukuha ni Pacquiao sa paglaban kay Clote? Hindi kasi nakikita ng ibang tao ang magandang hangarin ni Pacquiao sa ibang boksingero. Hindi lamang lumalaban si Pacquiao sa pansariling kapakanan, kundi ginawa rin niya itong paraan para mapaangat ang ibang boksingero at hindi pumipili ng makakalaban. Sa direktang kasabihan ay may magandang puso si Pacquiao. Binigyan ni Pacquiao si Clotin ng pagkakataon na may iprobe sa buong mundo na siya dapat ang nanalo sa laban kay Koto dahil sa may ginawang milagro sa scorecard. Kaya ito ay natalo at maraming boxing expert na niniwala na panalo si Clote sa laban. Isang pagkakataon nito ni Clote na ipakita sa buong mundo na karapat dapat ito sa panalo. Madali lang tinalo ni Pacquiao si Clote by a technical knockout pero sa kanya ay mahihirapan si Pacquiao. Alam ni Pacquiao na isang sugal ito sa kanyang boxing career. Malaki, matangkad at may power si Clote pero hindi kagaya si Pacquiao sa ibang champion na namimili ng makakalaban. Susugal lang sa laban kung 101% na kaya niya ang kalaban. Ito ang highlight sa kanilang laban mga boss na ginanap sa Texas, USA. May boxing record si Clote noon na 35 wins, Ray Loses and 21 knockout. Samantala naman si Manny Pacquiao ay may boxing record na 50 wins, 3 loses and 38 knockout. Referee called in fresh rule when he act like, like clapped his head between both heads. 
And, and, and you see him in the corner where Manny just pummeling him right here with some great shots in there. Nothing that landed that clean, but... for Cote, and uh, that left Flotty having the with the trainer you prefer. Yeah, but I, I, I was not super impressed with this trainer before, so I think Larry DeJesus would do very well. But I mean, psychologically, it could be a problem. Yeah, but I don't think DeJesus is sort of a, a last resort. Pacquiao, of course, his relationship with Freddie Rhodes is probably the strongest relationship of any fighter and trainer in the now, this is when Manny has a good chance to try to hit Flotty when he starts punching, and that's when he leaves himself open. See that? When he punches, he pulls his head off. And that's when Manny has to try to catch when he's punching himself. 30 years, there have been three star fighters from Ghana. The very great Asuma Nelson fought to win in every fight. You know, except when he stepped up against Paul that's Bessie, right. But he knew he was fighting Manny Pacquiao. When he steps up in class, he loses And himself. what we all knew is that he would have to be someone he's not to win. But still, out him. I think he would do more if he would throw more punches me to Cloudy, but, you know, it's somewhere along the line, I know Manny... Manny Pacquiao catches opponents in combinations, in exchanges. Well, the best way to stay on your feet is not to open up against Pacquiao. Another onslaught by Pacquiao to... He's, he's clear, you know, Cloudy's not known for a high output, output in the first place. Um, and now he's facing a guy who can punch and who's throwing a hundred punches around and stepping around him and boxing him beautifully. Move your hands at your own peril. He take the risk. He doesn't think like a champion. And Marte was right there with Delaware for 12 rounds. Oscar took it. And if he's elected, he enters the legislature as a representative in July. And who knows what that bang, 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 bang. Try and stop it. Bang, bang. Here I come. Answers because the win is already out of reach if he doesn't. It's going to have to be a knockout for him to win. And he's still able to release his hands. To nothing, 90 to 81, Manny Pacquiao based on all those clean punches. I mean, and like you said, ring general Max Kellerman winds up in the Pacquiao corner with training Leonard De Lenny DeJesus. Max, take it away. Lenny DeJesus, early on, Vladi seemed to be countering at times effectively, never moving his hands enough. At this point, he obviously needs something dramatic to win. And he doesn't want to take the chance. Simple as that. Thanks, buddy. Fascinating. Two years ago, Pacquiao was fighting at 135. Now Lenny believes that he's taking so he don't want to take a risk. And that's just why Manny is a champion. Manny went down. You know, round after the haste. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. He tried to kind of take a chance in his way early in the round, and then got discouraged and went back to who he is. See what Manny's doing? Well, he gets hit by something, and yeah, he comes right back. If you hit me, I'm gonna come back with five more punches. That's, that's what the I Well, in Mosley's mind, he's probably thinking, I'll trade with him. Let's see if he's as hard a puncher as I am. Well, that is the fight, even though it doesn't have a mock excitement is generated during the fight itself. That fight is a fight with a puppet punch and has made himself. Miller takes care of business against Mosley. Down the stretch they come. It looks as though Manny Pacquiao's spectacular winning streak continues. Tapos ang laban sa isang one-sided na panalo. Panalo si Pacquiao by a unanimous decision. Hindi masyadong bumato ng suntok si Clote sa ilang mga rounds. At panay na lang dipinsa ang ginagawa. At mayroon pang ang rounds na pinagsabay ni Pacquiao ang kanyang dalawang suntok sa tainga ni Clote. Para maduling na lang ito. Pero lang mga boss, masyado lang talagang matigas ang dipinsa ni Clote. 
para bang turtle? Dahilan rin para matalo siya sa scorecard ng mga hurado. Matapos ang ilang taon ay may ibinulgar si Joshua Clote kung bakit bihira lang itong sumusuntok sa laban ni Pacquiao. Nakita ko ito sa isang boxing site ng sportingnews.com isinulat noong taong October 18, 2018. Ayon kay Joshua Clote, isang malaking mistake ang ginawa niyang hindi bumato ng suntok sa laban kay Pacquiao. Pero sa totoo lang ay okay na lang kung ganun ang nangyari. Sa panahong iyon ay may hindi pagkakaunawaan si Clote at ang kanyang manager na si Vincent Scolpino. Tingin ni Clote sa kanyang manager ay ginagago siya pagdating sa kanilang agreement o kasunduan. Natutulungan siya ng kanyang manager sa mga pinansyal hanggang sa hindi pa kumikita si Clote ng $70,000 per fight at kukunan pa ng 33% ang kinikita ni Clote sa laban. Hanggang sa kumikita na si Clote ng mahigit o lampas pa sa $70,000 kada laban ay nawala na lang ng parang bula ang kanyang manager. Hindi na nito ginagawa ang tungkulin bilang isang manager, kaya ang promoter na lang ang gumagawa at humahanap ng makakalaban ni Clote. Nagpapakita lang ang kanyang manager pagkatapos ng laban, sabay kuha sa 33% na kinita ni Clote sa laban. Hanggang sa laban ni Clote kay Pacquiao ay hindi pa rin nagpakita ang kanyang manager. Pagkatapos ng weigh-in ni Clote kay Pacquiao ay pinuntahan niya ang kanyang manager sa hotel na tinutuloyan. At sinabi niya ang kanyang hinain at gusto ni Clote na babaan ang 33% sa 27% na makukuha ng kanyang manager sa laban. Pero hindi sumangayon ang kanyang manager sa gusto ni Clote. Kaya ito na lang ang ginawa ni Clote sa laban ni Pacquiao. When I fought Pacquiao, I decided I was going to defend myself. I wasn't going to fought my life on the line for people who did nothing but take from me. It was all about business for Vinny and I'm going in there. Taking fancy so that he can take a big portion, even though you don't speak to me. Ito ang katutuhanan sa likod na hindi pagbato ng suntok ni Clote sa laban ni Pacquiao. So yan muna ang ating video sa ngayon mga boss. Maraming salamat po.